find you out. You won't really go that easily. Just clop away like some nice old cart horse. Oh no, when Equus leaves, if he leaves at all, it'll be with your intestines in his teeth. And I don't stock replacements. The boy's in pain, Martin. Yes. And you can take it away. Yes. Then that has to be enough for you. All right. I'll take it away. What then? He'd feel himself acceptable. What then? Do you think feelings like his can be simply reattached? Like plasters stuck on other objects we select? I mean, look at him. My desire might be to make of this boy an ardent husband, a caring citizen, a worshipper of abstract and unifying God. My achievement, however, is more likely to make a ghost. I'll heal the rash on his body. I'll erase the welts cut into his mind by flying manes. And when that's done, I'll put him on a metal scooter and send him puttering off into the concrete world and he'll never touch hide again. Hopefully, he'll feel nothing at his fork but approved flesh. I doubt, however, with much passion. Passion, you see, can be destroyed by a doctor. It cannot be created. You won't gallop anymore, Alan. Horses will be quite safe. You'll save your money every week and change that scooter for a car and spend glorious weekends grooming that. You'll pop round to the betting shop and put the odd 50 pence on the nags, quite forgetting that they ever meant anything more to you than bearers of little profits and little losses. You will, however, be without pain, almost completely without pain. And now, for me, it never stops. The voice of Equus out of the cave. Why me? Why me? First, account for me. How can I? In an ultimate sense, I cannot know what I do in this place. But I do ultimate things, irreversible things. And I, I stand in the dark with a blade in my hand, striking at heads. I need, more desperately than my children need me, a way of seeing in the dark. What way is this? What dark is this? I cannot call it ordained of God. I cannot go so far. I will, however, pay it so much homage. There is now in my mouth this sharp chain. And it never comes out. <laughs> 